Hey guys, and welcome back to my channel. So I am continuing on with my alphabet challenge. Um, it's been a couple days since I have recorded anything um, because as you guys know, I have not been out of my house since like, I don't know, March, I think, like late March. Anyway, um, and I went to go get my nails done all the time. Um, because I am a lifetime biter of my nails, and it I knew it was only a matter of time before my nails are gone. My nails are gone. Poof. I have ugly, like, eaten nails. Anyway, so I was contemplating um, doing the videos, um, getting, you know, buying press-on nails, which I did, um, and I did a big, long series of, but anyway, they they bruise my nails because they, they sit on top of my nails, and I'm not used to having anything on my nails, so uh, I know y'all don't care about any of that, but I figured I would explain my not-so-pretty nails anymore, um, so yeah. Anyway, moving on, um, I'm sure most of you that watch the video don't really care about my nails, um, so I was self-conscious about that for a long time, and then finally I just decided to, you know, do it because most of the people that watch the videos or um, come and support me or whatever are supporting what I do, not what any part of me looks like. So I'm just taking a deep breath and mushing on, if you will. So anyway, we're on letter M as in mommy. And um, I couldn't figure out what to do with this one because uh, the other girls did magazine, but I don't really do mixed media very what, very much. So I don't really have, like, uh, we don't buy magazines. Um, we don't have subscriptions to magazines. They don't come in the mail or anything like that. So uh, I don't really have them. Um, what magazines I do have are National Geographic, and they're for my kids, so I didn't want to take them apart. <laughs> so... Um, I decided to do mini or miniature, and I thought that this would be a lot of fun. Um, so there is this cute little envelope punch. I'm going to, um, I'm going to use this just to create a little miniature envelope, but I think I'm going to decorate these tags, but I really want to show you the miniature envelopes because these things are really, really cool if I don't break it first. Um, bloop, bloop. Is that right? Yeah, that's right. I don't know what I just did other than break it. And the glory of ugh, turning the camera on. What can go wrong will go wrong. All right. There we go. Oh, nope. I lied. I might have to have Wayne fix this because I don't know what I just did to it. But it has come unclicked from itself. Oh, it broke. That's what it is. It broke. All right. Well, I'm going to see if I can't fix that. Because I do really, really like this. And it's still usable. You just have to be, you just have to pay very close attention to it. Um, but I'm going to, I'm going to kind of rig this up real quick. I'm just going to put a dab of glue right there and a little dab of glue right there just so I can show you guys because I really wanted to show you. Ow. Warm. Oh, guess what? I'm playing with hot glue again. Alright. We're just going to let that sit for a second. Alright. I even think about hot glue when I burn myself. That's crazy. All right, um, hopefully that's not going to stay at all. Okay. Stay. Meow. <laughs> We're so rigging this up. Stay. Think it'll stay? I bet I can probably email them and be like, look, I, I have a video where I just pushed the button and it broke. Like, it broke on camera. Y'all can go watch it if you want. But, um, yeah, I've only used this thing, like, three times. So, maybe if I send them an email, they'll, like, replace it or something. Because it's, it's a brand name. It's We Are Memory Keepers. And it ain't, it's not even going to try to fix. Nope. The glue's dried and it's like, nah, -uh, not going to happen. 
Okay, well, disregard. I, I, I. This is fun, though. <laughs> Maybe I should just delete this little video and start over. I don't know. Anyway, no, I'm not going to do that. But I am going to um, make this little envelope real quick. Cause, mainly because I want to show you guys this paper. This paper is so pretty. I kind of came across it on accident. I made it. But um, I was playing with my brushes on one of my applications. And I kind of made it by accident. I was like, oh my gosh, that's so cool. I want to play with it. So I printed it twice. One on the other side. So I'm just going to cut a little piece real quick. I need, let's see, the card size. We'll do a little bitty one. How about a two by three? So we'll be four and an eighth by four and an eighth. If I can still make this thing work. Because it, it may or may not work. I don't know. We'll see. All right. Four and an eighth by four and an eighth. Oh, look, I can make two of them. Oh. If I can make the thingy work that much or that, that for that long. All right, and that's it. I'm not starting the clock right now. This is just something extra that I wanted to do that I wanted to show you guys, but then my thing broke and I was like, oh no. Um. So I'm just going to have to very gingerly work this out. What did we do? Four and an eighth, four and two and three eighths. Three eighths. Two and three eighths. Right there. Hey, it worked. Oi. Go back. <laughs> you want to work. All right. Stay there. And I need another hand, is what I need. Where are you, Lane? All right. Now, line that up with that. No, stay. All right. Punch. Maybe I'm only going to make one of these because this is painful. <laughs> yeah, I'm definitely going to email them there and see if they can send me a replacement because I've used this like three times, I think. And it's really, really cute and I do like it a bunch. Um... It's exactly like the big one, just miniature sized. And at the moment, broken. Now, I wonder if you can't use the big one for these little miniature ones. I wonder if you could do that. You probably can. It's just this one's tinier. It fits on your desk better. As long as it's not broken. Which I think is funny. Ugh. Okay. Now that my fingers are like completely shot. Okay. Um. Nope. It doesn't go that way. It goes that way. I can't believe it broke. That is crazy. I think this is the first We Are Memory Keepers item that I have ever had that has malfunctioned and or broke. Because technically it didn't malfunction. It still works. It's just a pain in the tush to do. So I printed this on both sides. That way when I fold it up and create my little tiny miniature envelope here, the decoration is going to be on the inside and the outside. See? Cool.
cool, huh? Anyway, I thought those were super, super cute. Uh, I think I like this one. This one better. Whee! I actually kind of want to grab my big one just to see if it'll make the little tiny ones. But anyway, yeah, I made this, um, I designed this paper kind of accidentally. I was, because that's honestly how a lot of my stuff comes about is accidental. Um, I'm playing with this, that, or another, and I'm like, oh, that's really cool. And end up, you know, making all kinds of stuff. I'm going to open up my camera real quick, and I'm going to zoom in, because we are playing with minis today. So, wrong way. Go that way. All right. And y'all get to see my fugly hands. Don't judge me. I hope y'all don't judge me, but I don't think anybody will. I think I judge myself harder than anybody else does, to be honest with you. All right. So, I'm going to find the clock. All right, and we're going to hit start. And we're going to do mini, miniature, minute, itsy bitsy. And no idea what I'm going to do with these. All I know is they're tiny. Um, I do have some words that I printed out, and I don't know if any of them will work. But we can try it out. And this was um, something else I was playing with was writing. So I wrote a bunch of words. Alright, so there's that one. Okay, I like that. Let's grab my ink as soon as I find it. This stuff can go over there. I'm throwing stuff. No bueno. No bueno. Alright. So we're just going to make this all pretty up after I throw it. And I just use a, a pencil. An app, like an eye pencil in my app to both create brushes, write, you know, all kinds of stuff. There we go. All right, now let's see. We've got this guy here I can use. It's a little big. There we go. Maybe like that. See how many times I can burn myself in this video. I was on the phone with my daughter and my husband earlier. She picked up her cap and gown today. And she, anyway, she was talking to me on the way home. I was like, ah! She's like, what do you do? I was like, burn myself again. She's like, do you ever not burn yourself? Like, nope. Burn myself all the time. But at least it's not bad. I mean, it's not like I severely burn myself. Just enough to say, ow. <laughs> like, ow, that's hot. Don't touch. I like that. I like it. I like it. I like it. Let's play with some of this stuff. Oh, there's an edge. Oh, let's color you a little bit. I 
and basically brushing its hair with an ink brush. Now I'm just spreading its little furs out. So it's all crazy. Alright. Oops. Oh, I really don't want that playing right now. Sorry, my music was about to turn on. And I don't think anybody wants to listen to the music that I listen to. Well, not anybody that watches my channel anyway. <laughs> I don't know though. You might. What kind of music y'all listen to? Then again, I'd probably get yelled at. Copyright stuff, you know. Um, I like that a lot. That's really cute. Um, so I listen to all kinds of stuff. I mostly listen to rock. Um, it's like a metal rock, like Disturbed. I listen to Disturbed. I love Disturbed. They're one of my favorites. Um, let's see. Um, From Ashes to New is another one of my favorites. I don't know if anybody knows that one. Uh, Gemini Syndrome. I love them. them. Oh, I love them. And let's see. Uh, what is it? Bad Wolves. I like them too. There are a couple of their songs on their um, on their last album that are a little too much for me though. Because, I mean, don't get me wrong. I like, I, I can deal with some of the growling and such like that that's in a lot of the metal but some of it is just a little much and I'm like no nah, I'm good I'm good thanks dude but I like that so these are little um like little tiny snippet thingies that I had put together before I turned the camera on just so I would have little tiny um, embellishments to go with my little tiny um, tags. Kind of like the yellow. I like the yellow. I like that. Um, let's see. Who else? I listen to all kinds of stuff though. Um, I also have, I have a, an office album or an office playlist on my, on my iTunes. And in that playlist is mostly rock, but there are some things that are not like, um, Halsey. I love Halsey. Um, but she's not, obviously she's not rock. Um, let's see what else. Um, oh, Chris Daltrey, uh, one of my favorites. I really like him. Another cute little tag. Uh, let's see. We can put. Actually. Yeah, we'll, we'll tie it. I was wondering if I should tie it or just glue it, but I think we'll tie it. I still have my seam bending over here. I have not cleaned off my desk in <laughs> a couple weeks. Don't cut the power cord to the glue gun. That would be bad. All right. you in there and nope. there we go voila 
Oh, I like that. That is really cool. Oh, we, I don't think we did anything for the other one. Where'd you go, other one? Oh, I have this really cool ribbon over here. I can use, and I'm going to still use the eyelash trim as soon as I find the end of it. I literally just had it in my hand. There it is. All right. Let's go with that much. So this is just some lace. Uh, I'm pretty sure I have that in the shop right now. Uh, I'm going to color my lace or color my, my thing thing, my this stuff. So it's not quite so white. Whee! It's a good way to spread it all out too. It's kind of cool. See how it's all spread out now? That's pretty neat. Now I'm going to close it all back up again. So what kind of music do you guys listen to? I'm curious. It's funny because um, I remember Maddie one day was playing like a trivia or something and she had asked us to send her you know some questions and answers and such and one of them was favorite music and I was like oh I don't know how to answer that <laughs> but I had uh I'd put on their rock because it's probably the closest thing to the most I listen to. Um, anyway, there were a couple people that were just like, no, we're not surprised. It's you. I was like, I cannot guess people's favorite kind of music. Not like that. I like that. I like the dark um, tie, like tassel part of it. I like that a lot. All right, let's see. I want to go pink with this one. I can do pink. Oof. Let's see. I just happen to have some of this um, trim that I haven't inventoried yet. It's just extra trim because I had bought extras. Um, or because it came in multiple spools, but I only inventoried one of the spools, you know, stuff like that. Like this particular one, this is in my shop already. So is the brown one, actually. Um, it's so tiny. Bloop, bloop, bloop. Bloop, bloop, bloop. Oh, I could probably go around the whole thing. I don't want to do that. Um, I'm just going to kind of glue up the back of this. Because it's like woven, if you will. And I don't want it to unweave itself. Okay. Try not to show you guys my funky nails. <laughs> I swear I think I'm more concerned about it than you guys are. Because I know that some people are, you know concerned about stuff like that. Like, how could you go on YouTube and show your hands if your hands aren't all pretty? Well, I mean, technically they are just what they are. I mean, there's a lot of people that don't go out and spend extra money just to go make their hands pretty so they can play with arts and crafts and mess them all up. I mean, one of my favorite YouTubers is one of those people. She does not go and get her nails done. She just crafts. Actually, most of the YouTubers that I watch just craft. They don't worry about all that mess. I'm like, yeah, I'm going to be more like them when I grow up. No idea what's on the top right now. Oh, gosh, we are doing so good. We have 17 minutes left. Well, I guess doing smaller things, you would spend less time doing them because you're you don't have as much space to decorate all right 
Um, oh, and these little tags I had gotten, uh, you can get them from Caroline, our Etsy shop. I wonder, though, if we can't. Meowth, meowth, meowth. What are you going to look like? It looks like a house. I need to move the camera up. I'm too far up. Nope. Nope. There we go. Ah, uh, let's see what this does. Um. Hum, 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 hum. Uh, let's see. Let me take this. So you got over here. Oh, uh, we have a creamier one. It's a little bit wider. Maybe just on the bottom. Let's see. taking one of these little scallops and I'm gonna trim it up just a smidge but yeah I tried the whole um, press on nail thing because I, I do know that some people can can wear those and they look great on them and I did that for a while I mean did it for about a week or two um, but they're press on so you know they start coming off coming loose or whatever anyway when they did I knew that my hands hurt when I had them on but I was just like you know it's I just I don't know made excuses for it I guess but anyway when I had taken them all off my all of my nail beds were so bruised I was like oh my gosh you could probably see them but I'm not going to show you guys my nappy nail beds um but yeah, they were very bruised. And I was like, yep, not doing that anymore. Y'all are just going to have to deal with my nappy nails. Or the lack thereof. I used to tell Haven, I was like, I got man fingers. It's kind of funny. I like that. Whee! Alright, let's see. I wonder if I could get this through that hole. <laughs> I don't know if I can. Well, I can. Alright, let's go with this amount. Oh, that is a lot. I'm trying to like spread it across the bottom too. I don't know if this is going to work, but we're going to try it. I wonder if I should put the eyelash trim with it. I think I should, because it's cool. Alright. So I was thinking about doing just regular craft with me videos. 
Um, but I wanted to get y'all's opinion on it. Like, do y'all wanna do y'all wanna see regular old craft with me videos? Cause I know there's a lot out there. Um, and I don't wanna bore you guys to death. I mean, I did contemplate doing this as well, but Miss Gail was like, "Go for it." Okay. So I did. And I'm really grateful that I did. I'm, I'm glad that I took her advice. I really like this one. It's very elegant and just cute and girly. So cute and pink and girly. I don't know if y'all can see the pink or not. Let me see. Uh, no, that just made it dark. Um, turn this one off. Wee! That's just dark. Now I feel like I can't see anything because it's so dark in here. But it's not like white now, like glary. I mean, it still is if I that's just the light out of the out of my window but I'm gonna turn those back on because it's like really dark in here without my lights so anyway that's that I'm gonna put these in my bucket I have a bucket where I keep like my pre-made stuff that I made um, I should probably keep the hearts and stuff in here too, because I do use them. I didn't make them, but I do use them, and they're pre-made embellishments. So, as soon as I find them, oh, I set them up there. Put them in there too. There we go. But I had a, it's just a box full of little pre-made embellishments. Yeah, stuffs like that. And then as I use it up and create stuff like this, this will go in that box and then it'll go on the shop. So, yeah, there you go. So anyway, that's it. Uh, I'm sure there's plenty of time left because those were itsy bitsy teensy weensy. See, that's what I could have used for I. Itsy bitsy teensy weensy. <laughs> All right, there we go. So that's it. I hope you guys liked this video. Um, we still have eight and a half minutes left. That's crazy. <laughs> like, I don't know. That's crazy. So anyway, thank you guys so much for watching um, <laughs> and putting up with the crazy at the beginning. Oh my gosh, the beginning of this video was nuts. Anyway, you guys have a wonderful day. I hope to see you guys again, and I will talk to y'all later.